New on Daybreak, using creativity and technology to ease a pain that many frontline workers know all too well during the coronavirus pandemic. News 8's Angelique Cockaday spoke with a couple from Williamsport, Indiana. They are 3D printing ear savers, Angelique. Yeah, that's right. Good morning. Debbie Slater is a pharma tech at Ascension St. Vincent Hospital in Williamsport. During the pandemic, she says she's seeing nurses and doctors with bruising around their face and pain behind their ears caused by wearing a mask for 12 hour shifts. Debbie says one day she saw a nurse wearing an ear saver and immediately thought of her husband, Paul, a retired engineer. Paul then made a few tweaks to the ear savers design and 3D printed them. He says the ear savers do two things. It takes the strain off of the ear and helps the mask fit better. Now, after handing out a few samples to colleagues, Debbie and Paul's 3D printed creation caught the attention of the hospital newsletter, where nursing staff 80 miles away in Fishers heard about them. It's a lot of pressure behind the ears, so I think that just even those little small acts of kindness can really add up, you know, to somebody who's using their creativity and their talents at home with this 3D printer. It just kind of makes a little bit more comfortable for us in an uncomfortable environment. I owe the hospitals uh, over here a great debt. So whatever I can pay back, you know, is uh, it, it gives me the feel good. Yeah. Natalie says the nursing staff was using safety pins and paper clips, but now the entire nursing team in the Fisher's ER is using Debbie and Paul's ear savers. Now, Debbie told me Paul is retired and needs something to help keep him busy, and Paul says he's ready to go. So if you know someone who could use these ear savers, we'll get the story up on wishtv.com. Back to you. Good to know, Angelie. Thank you. 616 right now.